In this video, we'll bounce the equation for FeCl3 plus MgO. This is iron 3 chloride plus magnesium oxide. Let's count the atoms up on both sides of the equation. So we have one iron, three chlorine atoms, one magnesium, and then just the one oxygen here. Product side, we have two irons, chlorines we have two, magnesiums one, oxygens three. It looks like, I usually like to leave the oxygens to last. Uh, let's do the irons. We could put a two here in front of the iron three chloride. One times two, that'd give us two. So the irons would be balanced. Three times two, that gives us six chlorine atoms. So we could just go over here and fix the chlorine. It looks like we'll need to put a three as our coefficient here because three times two, that'll give us six. That would balance the chlorine atoms. And then one times three, now we have three magnesium atoms. Might as well do the magnesium. We could put a three as our coefficient. We have one times three. Now the magnesium atoms are balanced and one times three, and it just works out so nice. The oxygens are balanced and we're done. This equation is balanced. Note, this is a double displacement reaction. The iron and the magnesium, they switch places. So in the products, the iron, instead of with the chlorine, the iron's now with the oxygen and the magnesium is with the chlorine. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.